Hey what's up guys and welcome back to today's video so people always asking me what kind of tweak you have in your iDevice and what kind of theme that you already use what about your DAC and what kind of tool you arrange your icons with it what about the control center so today's video I decided to make a perfect jailbreak setup that I already set on my iDevice so I'm about to show you guys and go through most of the tweaks that I already set on my jailbroken device anyway as always before I'm gonna be start today's video let me ask you guys to give the video a big thumbs up also make sure to subscribe hit that notification bell so you will be notified always whenever I release a CD at week video Okay, so let me go ahead first of all and talking about the most animated wallpaper or some of the animated stuff widget that I already use on my both jailbroken device right now. So the first one that I have on my right hand right now, I use the fluid. The second one that I have is going to be the background protocols, which is going to be really amazing. So this one, you guys already see it. This one that I have right now, which is a give my device really nice looking. Let me jump right now to talking about the most tweaks that I already run on my jailbroken device on my control center. So if I launch my control center, you can take a look right now. First one, I use the Taglo. So you can take a look how it's going to be really beautiful. Even it's going to be highlight some button here. If you already toggle that on or disable that, how it's going to be looks like. So this is the Taglo. The second one is going to be the cool CC is going to be make all that beautiful design as you might take a look right now. And the other one, which is I already like it, the power modules here. So it's going to be add some other modules. And also the other thing that I really like it about it is going to be provide you with respring bond here, which is going to be make your life easier. Let's go ahead right now and move to talking about the most stuff that I have on my home screen. So first of all, the icons, how I arrange my icons, I use the Poxy 3 and about the jump icons that I have on my dock, I already use the Bounce Notify 8 and the, uh, the DAC that I use right now, which is going to be the floating DAC and the other widgets and some other stuff like using the iPhone X style for the non X devices. I use the little XS. The widget will be in the description down below with the source if you want to download it. Speaking about the theme that I already use, you will be find the name in the description down below with other theme that I already use on my setup. Speaking about the home bar right now here and with the colors on it, I already got the Chrome home bar X. If you want to bring that kind of stuff, which is going to be really beautiful. The dark mode that I already use, which is going to be the dune here. Speaking about how can I use most the uh, widgets that I already put on my home screen, like screen, I already got the both the XN HTML and the XN info. If I want to go ahead right now talking about my volume hood here, this is the peekaboo lights here. If you want to customize the hood and place some colors, it is available from under the settings. If we go ahead right now and jump to talking about the most tweaks that I already set with my notification. If you guys want to take a look how is it looks like, it comes with the colors and even the style and everything it looks different. So I already used three different kind of tweaks. The first one will be the nano banners and the second one is going to be the notification and the other one will be the notifica. Let me go ahead right now and talking about the most tweak that I have on my settings here. So I use two different kind of tweaks. First one will be the shovel. It's going to be make the tweak separate than the apps here. And you can see right now the style of that tweak. And the second one will be the better settings. So this is how it's going to be. The settings going to be looks like. Speaking about the other tweaks that I already download on my iDevice, one of them is going to be the snowboard because I already jailbreak with Uncover. So I use the snowboard for my uh, other themes that I already use on my iDevice. 
So speaking about the OLED tweaks, one of them is going to be the Mapple for sure. It is really beautiful. Okay, so let's go ahead right now to speak about the other tweaks that I have on my iDevice. Talking about the other thing, which one of them is going to be the bar emoji. Bring the keyboard with the emoji. Another volume that I already use on my other device here to bring the iOS 13 volume hood, which is going to be that style right now here, which is going to be give my device even nice and beautiful looking. Anyway, there you go guys. This is the most tweak that I already use on my jailbroken device. So I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you like the video, please give it a big thumbs up. Make sure to subscribe, hit that notification bell so you will be notified always whenever I release a new CD tweaks video. Catch you with the next one. Peace out.